video I'm only going to show you the places that are open and vibrant. Milkshakes, oh la la. Some more surfboards, oh la la. Guys, I don't think there are many handbags in this place. All that work. AFL. This man's got it with the friendly people. Hello. Hello, how are you? And then we have a look. Only 200. Yeah, this boss. Oh my god, what are you selling? This lady says it's number one in yeah, Bali. Number one. Shop here, guys. Big shop there inside selling used branded clothes shop selling goose. You have a Jamie Oliver restaurant. Good afternoon from Bali, Indonesia. So today I'm here in Kuta and I'm on Jalan Pantai, which is basically the street from Legian to Kuta Beach. So we're going to take a stroll along here guys and I'm going to show you what's going on, all the shops, restaurants and everything along the way. So come with me. I'll just show you where I'm stood now. This is the street. And then this is, this is Legian this way. And then this is heading towards the bypass. So just, just before we walk down Jalan Pantai, I just want to show you a, a restaurant here on the corner of the opposite street. So it's called Don, Don Juan. start a walk now down towards Kuta Beach along Jalan Pantai. I'm gonna crisscross the street and just pick out places that may be of interest to you. On the opposite side of the road here we have a handbag shop. to shop and then the 
next one guys we have along the street is a place called Maids Warung very very popular Warung this one very busy inside has an upstairs season downstairs and reasonably priced menu seating it's all open and if you go down this alley that leads you to poppy's one um, i'm not going to be showing poppy's one really in any videos at the moment because poppy's one is a little bit in a disarray it's not really recovered from the pandemic and i don't want to show barley in that lie i'm just going to head in the main streets that have recovered and have got activity and tourists and things are all opening up ATM here, Danham and ATM, Mini Mart, convenience store. A nice shop here. So like wall decor on the side. artwork beautiful collection so this is the shop guys no name and then on this side we have a place selling paintings these are very big place called Soulmate, which has got some t-shirts, ladies clothing, and just a big array, great collection of clothing for men and women. And then next you have a ladies fashion shop, indie fashion. Oh, it's actually men and ladies. Beautiful clothes here. Some nice dresses, shirts for men. So even on this street, guys, there is quite a few places closed. I'm not going to include those in the video. I'm only going to show you the places that are open and vibrant. There's quite a lot of activity on this street so you don't need to worry there is going to be a lot open that you're going to see as I walk down to the beach however I won't include closed doors and shutters and things like that on my video we have another shop here called Tamarara Danielle selling a huge array of products again Deco. So if you're into that kind of thing guys, this might be a place for you. Beautiful collection inside. It's really nice stuff. So we have a tourist information resident. Well not tourist information, this will just be a place for booking your tours here guys. It's just a little booth on the side. So that looks like a quite new massage that's recently opened I think here. We have another street, another shop selling all your AFL. Got it. Bags. And next we have 
so my massage and spa on this side with the friendly people hello how are you this is the prices the soma body massage we have you face treatments foot massage Chocolate massage, interesting. The collection here. Some nice ladies' clothing. This is just across from Soma Massage, guys, and then this is the owner. There's a huge array of dresses inside. So we've got another salon spa here. Just opposite the Circle K. Just opposite the Circle K, you have another painting shop. Many of these shops now, I can't include them all in a video because there's too many of them. They're literally one after the other next door, all selling very, very similar items to what I've already shown you in the video. I'll just walk past and give you a brief look at them. Yes. Hello, how are you, sir? How are you? Good. Good. Looking here. Selling handbags in this one. Coming. So I just have a big, big, long line of shops now, guys. Well, in all very similar things. Massage and spa here, guys. It's a little massage place. And then you have another spa here called Hera Spa. Hello, how are you? Very good, thank you. Maybe you want to ask No, I'm just video. Alright. Sorry, Mum, tattoo.
beautiful sculptures and paintings on the wall. Just at the back of this whole um, restaurant, guys, we have a hotel called the Bali Summer Hotel. I'll just briefly show you the, the swimming pool that backs right onto the restaurant. So there's only a couple of guests here at the moment, and there's the seating, and I presume all the rooms are located down there. And then just across the road, guys. If you've got a headache, Kima Farmia Apotics is the place for you. And then we have the Pora Asi Hotel. We've got a special promo on. Only 200. So this is the parking area and then that must be the hotel in there guys. And there's another collection of t-shirts here. Great collection of t-shirts and handbags. Also has watches as well. So that's Jump Shops. It doesn't have a name but it's an extra shop called Asia Sport. Just shop selling all your football t-shirts. Huge collection. <laughs> oh my god what are you selling brother <laughs> and then you have another accommodation option here called Koja Beach Inn Hello. just there off the main street and then you have Carla Day Spa this is a very popular spa here in Bali this has got branches all over Bali yeah number one in Bali Oh, that's Carla Spa Carla guys. Spa. This lady says it's number one in yeah, Bali. Number one. Number one. Studio. And everything 100 shop here, guys. It's a big shop there inside selling bags, sunglasses, hats. Have a bing bong here, guys. Drink and dessert. 
desert. Wow, look at those for milkshakes. Ooh la la. Sounds like some really nice ice creams there guys. I don't think the camera's going to pick it up too well. which is a convenience store and it also has a Commonwealth ATM more of the same shops along here guys yes, yeah. and you have a Kimberley Spa this is another popular spa here in Bali Spa here, smart spa, it's got a beautiful entrance. That's smart spa, guys. And then across, we have a jewelry shop called Malink Jewelry. It sells some really, really unique items. Beautiful products. So just next to Blink guys, just down this side street here, there's a big market in the back. We'll just take you a walk through and just see. So you're going to go through the back here. And then you just have a huge array of the same on the street. But it's just a big market right at the back here. We have a Kentucky Fried Chicken on the corner here. And then just round this way is Cooter Square. Hello! And that's the KFC on the corner. Okay guys, so there's a bit of a break now between um, the turning left for Cooter Square and where we've just shown you the KFC and then there's a bit of a break now with the shops um, and there's a lot of construction on the side. Um, and then we're just almost at Cooter Beach now. Blue Panic here. This is a branded clothes shop selling goose. There's the interior. Sells so all these brands. We have a place called Snapback here, guys. So, so Snapback, what Snapback do is they customise t-shirts and caps. Anything you want putting on a t-shirt and cap, this is a great place to come. And that's the shop on the inside, so you just pick your cap or your t-shirt and they can print anything you want on it. We have a big Alpha Mart here guys, which is another convenience store with a coffee shop. This is quite a nice one here. Across the road from the Alpha Mart, you have a Jamie Oliver restaurant. Very nice dining facility. Hotel with the shops also down at the bottom here. And then you have another nice premium brand clothing shop here. So we're just on the final walk now down to Kuta Beach. Literally 30 seconds and we'll arrive at the gates to Kuta Beach.
got the Grand Inner Hotel here on the left hand side. And this is the gates to Kuta Beach but at the moment it looks as though there's some construction going on. And that's the road all along the beach. Construction going on here at the moment. So we just have to go down this way and just show you the beach. So there appears to be a lot of construction work going on around this area at the moment. Um, there's a big ledge to the beach which I haven't seen before. Uh, it looks completely different, but I'll just show you Kuta Beach. So this section of Kuta Beach is actually quite empty. guys so that concludes my tour of Jalampantai from Legian right down to the gates entering Kuta Beach um, unfortunately Kuta Beach doesn't look too much good at the moment because they are doing some construction work here um, however I'm sure that'll be all okay um, in the not too distant future um, hope I've showed you um, enough on the street what's available on this street um, in off, um, on offer to you um, tried to include as much as I can there is a lot more on the street as well I've just picked certain places out that I feel may be of interest to you because there are a lot of shops that tend to repeat themselves selling the same things etc um, so I've just tried to include as much as I can in this video for you guys hope you've enjoyed the video and I shall say bye for now Bye.